Hi everyone. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. It's Elsa. Nice to meet you. Today, I have my Starbucks iced chai latte with oat milk today. I just want to talk about like, well first of all I think this is going to be like a book store library homework type of vlog which is exciting I haven't been book shopping in a while which is kind of what I want to talk about right now is that like I feel like I haven't really felt like myself in a while which is weird because it's not like a specific feeling it's like it's like the lack of a feeling for me like I just don't really I don't know it's just weird and then last night, yesterday was Friday the last day of March and the new Boy Genius album came out and I listened to it and I watched like the film which was three of their songs and the video was directed by Kristen Stewart and I just like, that really felt like something that I would have done like a year ago and I really felt like myself doing that and that made me just realize that like I really haven't felt like myself in a long time. So today I have my coffee. I'm just going to do homework and go shop for books which are all things that I've liked doing forever and I know that they're things that make me feel like me. So yeah, that's what's happening. Um. I don't really know what's up with me. It's just this like weird, like I don't know. I don't really know. So yeah. <laughs> Anyways, totally you should listen to the Boy Genius album. I absolutely loved it. Like really, really loved it. Their music is so like, the lyrics are good and like weird and interesting but also the music is so like music focused you know it's not all about the content of the lyrics it's a lot about like you know the harmonies and the fact that there's three of them and they sing the harmonies together and like their voices just blend so well yeah that album is really really good i will be listening to it again probably several times today 100% recommend anyway I'm actually filming another video right now but I will see you guys later when I do homework or head to the bookstore
Hi everyone. It's like 6.45 now. My hair is wild. I literally was kind of planning on being back to my dorm at like 4 when I originally planned out this day. And now it's clearly much later than that. But it's so... It was like 70 degrees out this afternoon. Um, I think I walked six miles. <laughs> I think I'm gonna have blisters on the bottom of my feet because I can like feel them when I walk. It's a little bit painful. <laughs> but anyways, I'm not even wearing my sweater vest anymore because I literally took it off in the public library bathroom and shoved it in my backpack along with my coat. Cause it's so <laughs> warm out. I was sweating while I was walking around which is so nice. It's time for a haul. First I have this apple, oh well, from the dining hall because I ate dinner. I was not planning on eating dinner there, but I missed the five o'clock shuttle literally by one minute. Like if the stoplight before it would have been a walk instead of a stop, I would have been able to get on and come back at five, but I missed it. So then I had to wait 30 minutes. So I was like, I might as well just eat dinner in Manhattan. So then I got on the six o'clock shuttle and that's why I'm home right now. Let's do a book haul. So I only got two books, which actually is kind of unfortunate because one of them is a buy one, get one 50% off and the other one is not. <laughs> But there was no other buy one get one 50% off book that I was really excited about. So I wasn't going to spend the extra dollars on a book that I wasn't super excited about. So the two books I got. The first one, this is the buy one get one 50. I got the White Album by Joan Didion, which as far as I can tell is kind of just a, like prose essays and yeah maybe some poetry or something but no it looks like it's just essays but I feel like I've heard about this so many times and the cover is pretty and yeah I'm really excited to read this I think it's gonna probably end up being my W in my alphabet I don't know what my W I have I know I have a W planned right now but it might end up being this instead because I don't have like physically own the book that I was planning on reading I think so yeah I'm excited for that one and then this one strongly influenced by Leonie the book Leo on YouTube I love watching her videos but um I have these Violet Delights by Micah Nemerover which I'm so excited to read I also I was considering getting The Cruel Prince instead which also is a book that Leonie recommends on her channel a lot but I feel like with fantasy books like The Cruel Prince I'm less likely to reread it because it's more plot based than character based although I mean I know that's not always the case but fantasy normally is like that for me and this one I feel like is more character driven so that's most of the reason why I got this one instead I feel like I'm more likely to reread it and also it was on the dark academia 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 it's academia right i think so it was on the dark academia table which makes me more excited to read it and this i had already planned on being my i think it's my t um so now i have a copy of it which is so exciting it's so Ready? I'm so excited. So both of these I'm actually really really excited to read. The public library was super gorgeous of course. I was only in there, I've never actually gone there to do work before and I only was in there for like probably half an hour or 45 minutes. I think I just um I just like finished drafting an essay that I have for extra credit. But I got there, I walked up there. It's on like 38th Street or something. I don't know, it's like pretty far up. Well, that's not really that far up there. But I walked there from 
Washington Square. I walked from Washington Square to, which is Fourth Street, about, to the Barnes and Noble at Union Square, which is Seventeenth Street, the top of Union Square. And then from Seventeenth Street, I walked to, like, whatever the public library is, like Thirty Ninth or something. So it was a long walk. Um, so anyways, I got to the public library and I was like sweating. So yeah, I didn't sit there for a super long time, but it was really humid this morning because it was raining. So I know that my hair is like, I had it down at the beginning of the day, but humidity does not, does not help my hair. Actually, it doesn't seem that bad. It's just kind of unfortunate because I literally washed it last night and this always happens where like I wash it and then it's like humid the next day and it gets all frizzy. So annoying. But anyways, I think that's, I think that's all. I hope that you enjoyed watching this silly little book vlog. Uh, it was really fun to film. I am really glad that I went and did this today and that it was so nice out because it made me feel a lot better than I have been feeling recently. You know, to do something fun and like do something really for myself. Uh, I'm so excited to read these books. I have to keep my alphabet thing going now. So I need to finish Little Women. I have about 250 pages left. Um, but I also have another midterm. I have a math exam on Tuesday, so I need to study. Oh my gosh, it's so nice out. Anyways, thank you for watching. Subscribe if you like to listen to me talk or watch one of my other videos. Uh, I'm so glad that you guys like to watch my videos. I appreciate you so much. And hopefully I will see you in another one. Adios.